Hi and welcome to Arizona Business Today, highlighting local business owners right here in Arizona. And today you're meeting Jason Pistillo. He is uh, the president and CEO of University of Advancing Technology right here in Arizona. Welcome. Good to talk to you. It's great to talk to you. Thanks for having me. Tell us how this idea went from one school to a beautiful university and then tell us about the university. Well, we were founded in 1983, 30 years ago, and fast forward to today, where we're just getting ready to celebrate our 30 year anniversary this weekend, and we've grown to be one of the most elite private colleges you've probably never heard of. Uh, if you're not a young technophile that's 14, 15, 16, probably living in another state, you've probably never heard of us. Computer geek. A computer geek. I'm a computer geek, so I get to say that. Everybody uh, is these days, these, or they want to be. Anyway. These days they are, and so our college campus is a little intimate, private, brick and mortar campus. There's about a thousand students attending the school and bachelor's and master's degrees. We have 25 programs. We're exclusively computer science and STEM. So we're one of the only all computer science and STEM schools out there. That's incredible. And I know you've had a great partnership for a long, long time with National Bank of Arizona. How have they helped you grow? National Bank of Arizona has been alongside us through thick and thin for since the 90s. And so what's really exciting about that is they've helped us build that intimate brick campus. They've helped us build our residence halls, uh, our dorm. They've helped us with multiple financing projects over the years. And so they've just stood beside us, like I said, for many, many years. Jason, where do the students come from? Well, UAT is a destination campus, and so our students come from all 50 states to attend the school in Arizona. Well, much continued success in the future. Thank you, Jan. And thank you for joining us for Arizona Business Today, sponsored by National Bank of Arizona.